But there are plenty of other tricky issues. Mr Cameron said repeatedly before the election that the computer hacker Gary McKinnon, who has Asperger's syndrome, should not be extradited to the US. He said he did raise the issue today. So did the new Lovin produce a result? Gosh, do you think it is time now to consider some leniency in this case? What I expect is that my team will follow the law, uh, but they will also coordinate closely with what uh, we've just stated is uh, an ally that is unparalleled in terms of uh, uh, our cooperative relationship. And I trust that this will get resolved in a way that uh, underscores the seriousness of the issue, but also uh, underscores the fact that uh, we work together and uh, we can find a, an appropriate solution. Good evening and welcome to the programme. The Prime Minister has said tonight that he's discussed the extradition of North London computer hacker Gary McKinnon with President Barack Obama. Speaking at the White House, David Cameron said he hoped a way through could be found. Gary McKinnon's mother has told BBC London tonight that she now hopes her son can go on trial here. Catherine Carpenter reports. Two men who had much to discuss at their meeting today. Now it's emerged that one of the topics covered was the case of Gary McKinnon. Authorities in the US want the 43-year-old from Wood Green to stand trial for hacking into secret military computers. Mr McKinnon, who has Asperger syndrome, has always claimed he was just looking for evidence of UFOs. The Prime Minister has previously condemned plans to extradite Mr McKinnon to the US and this evening he was asked to confirm his position in front of the American President. We completely understand that um, Gary McKinnon stands accused of uh, a very important and significant crime but I have had conversations with the US Ambassador as well as raising it today with, uh, with the President about this issue and, and I hope a way through can be, can be found. Mr Obama said he expected the UK and US to coordinate closely on the matter. I trust that this will get resolved in a way that uh, underscores the seriousness of the issue, but also uh, underscores the fact that uh, we work together and uh, we can find a, an appropriate solution. Tonight, Gary McKinnon's mother told BBC London she was surprised and amazed the leaders had discussed her son at such landmark talks. Two such powerful men uh, during that meeting with all the things going on with, with BP would take the time to discuss uh, Gary uh, is incredible, it really is and, and I've got so much hope now uh, for the fact that they did this and that we've got a, a government, a coalition government that will stand up for its own people I'm, I'm overwhelmed, I really am and I have happy tears She says she hopes this means their nightmare may soon be over Catherine Carpenter, BBC London News